Howdy folks, BC here. You're watching Deuce and Guns, and today we're going to talk about security. Now, it's a common knowledge that many criminals today actually get caught by what's in their hard drive. They don't destroy these enough. Now, I started thinking about that. What if we could go back in time and see what some of the older criminals did with their hard drives? You know, someone way, way back. Someone like, I don't know, Jesse James. First of all, to take out that hard drive, I'm going to shoot it with my black powder pistol. Now behind that ball, I'm going to be shooting 24 grains of black powder substitute. Not a full size charge, but definitely should let the hard drive know something's coming. All right. <laughs> Whew. Smoking. Let's go check that out. That was pretty good, actually. That was pretty good. They went right through the side there, and it actually took out the platter. That's where all the information is being stored, and it's basically a, a metal platter in there where all the uh, ones and zeros are stored, and it pretty much took that out. I'm actually surprised. I actually had a contingency plan just in case this didn't do anything, but 24 grains of black powder substitute definitely did a job on this. But I still got to shoot my rifle at it. Hold on, you're going to enjoy this. Now, just in case that pistol didn't work, I had a contingency plan here. 4570, government. Now, before anybody starts bellyaching about this, the 4570 government round was actually developed nine years before Jesse James was killed. Or several decades, depending on the conspiracy theory you believe. Let me go ahead and put my ears on, because this baby's loud. All right, one dead hard drive. <laughs> Woo. I believe that did a number on it. And it sure did, you can take a look at it. It went right through the center. It actually took out the motor and the whole mechanism that I'm not sure that the black powder pistol would actually got through. But it took out the motor, the mechanism, all the drive information, and of course the platter as well. So, if Jesse James could not get a really good hit with the revolver, the 4570 would have made sure that no police officer would be able to read his hard drive information. Well guys, that's it for me today. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and give me a like, favorite, and subscribe, because I'm going to make sure to do more of these in the future. You guys have a great day. See ya.